we're gonna do things a little bit different. Today I'm going to show you how I clean my iron skillet. Now there are so many different ways that people say to, to clean your iron skillet. Some say, do not use soap. Some people, man, if you use soap, especially in the South, they will get on you. But um, according to Lodge website, Lodge is a big cast iron skillet maker. According to their website, you can use a little bit of uh, dish soap in your iron skillet to clean it. Now, here I cooked some bacon earlier, so I don't have a huge mess. Let me see if you can see it. There's not a huge mess on here. So I'm actually not gonna use soap, but if you cook something with heavy grease or something like fish, or uh, when I use my iron uh, pot, my cast iron pot, I make gumbo. Sometimes I'll use dish soap in that just a little bit, but today I'm just going to show you how I clean just a skillet from everyday use and how to also make sure you get it ready to store in your cabinets. So first, I'm just gonna start with some hot water and I'm also gonna use this brush. This is a brush that I got from Amazon and I'll see if I can find the link for it, but it's a specifically for cast iron skillets and there are different kinds of cleaning tools that you can use, but I do like this one. So I'm gonna go ahead and just clean this out with hot water. Okay, my water is nice and hot, so I'm just going to run it in here, let it cover it completely, and then I'm just gonna start scrubbing away. And I'm not, like I said, I'm not gonna use soap this time. I don't feel like I need to. If there's anything that's stuck on there that's not coming off, this has a little um, edge on it to where you can scrub it off like that, but I don't think I need to. I just leave it under the hot water for a couple minutes while I'm scrubbing away. Go on the sides. And it's hot. Is any of that grease spattered? And that is all I did to wash it. Now I'm going to show you the next step. All right, I have a gas stove, so I have the heat, about a medium heat, and I put the skillet on there, and you will see the water start evaporating. And what I do is I just stand here and watch it. You don't want it on too high, but I just stand here and watch it. And if I see there are any areas, any spots like around the corners, like here's one little puddle right here, I'll just kind of move, move it to closer to the heat. But anyway, I'm just gonna keep it here until all of the water evaporates. All of the water has evaporated, so I'm gonna go ahead and turn off the heat. And while it is still warm, I'm going to add a little bit of cooking oil. You don't need to add much cooking oil at all. In fact, that may be a little too much, but I'll go ahead and rub this all on the inside of the skillet. And that gives it its nice coating. Now, it's still black, but that's okay because that is part of the seasoning. That made me nervous when I first saw that the first, first few times I used my iron skillet. But according to the Lodge website, that is okay and that is normal. But you want to try to get as much of 
the excess oil out of here that you have rubbed into the skillet. And then that is it. Once it cools off, then you can go ahead and put it away. That is how you clean and season a cast iron skillet. Okay guys, that is how I clean my iron skillet. Let me know in the comments below if that's how you clean yours and let me know if you do anything different. If you're new to my channel, thank you so much for stopping by. I really do appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please subscribe to my channel and click the bell button because it lets you know every time I upload a new video. Don't forget to click the thumbs up because it lets YouTube know that you are watching and happy cooking. I'll see you next time. Bye.